Sooner or later, everything in your life is going to tell you to stop. Everything's going to tell you to give up. Everything's going to test your limits. But that's okay. It's okay to be tested. That's how you get stronger. It's okay to cry. That shows you care. It's okay to want to give in. That means you're human. Rough times are going to come. They're going to beat you to the ground. But these times have not come to stay. They have come to pass. Sometimes not getting what you want is the most valuable experience of your entire life. Sometimes utter pain. Pain is the greatest ass in the world because when people succeed, they party, and when they fail, they ponder. That's where the change comes from. What if problems were always gifts? What if every single problem really was a gift in your life? What if every problem you ever had was life happening for you, not to you? What if everything in our lives was guided? What if everything in our lives was divine tithing? Everything. Even the pain. Every problem is temporary. Only your soul is permanent. This is not the end for you. There is still hope. If you can muster up enough strength to hold on and hold out, you can get through this. Because you're tougher than this. You can overcome more than you think you can. You're more powerful than you can ever begin to imagine. But the way you get to the next level of your life is keep going. Keep calling, keep running. Even when you don't even know it, you get turns into chaos. Because if you can operate in chaos, the world becomes Disneyland. Problems become scratches. I can lose my car. Somebody can blow it up. I'm gonna go have some sushi with my wife and think about the solution, not the problem. There is another level. The only reason you keep seeing there isn't is you feel so exhausted about where you are. But life, the universe, or God is just testing you because there is another level. There's a level where all your dreams are realized. There's a level that you've always dreamed about. It is real. It has not gone away. But it takes that extra burst when you think there's nothing left. There's no way. You've tried everything 10 million times and you keep going. If you keep hitting this wall enough times, I will see that you will not stop, that you are filled with that level of determination, faith, and courage, and then the door opens. And it's just two million years above that most people give up because they're exhausted. And if some people go, the harder I hit it, the more I hit it, sooner or later it's going down, I'm not stopping. And when you do that enough, it pops open. When you're in the darkest place, when you feel like all is lost, when you think, there's no way to turn it around. Remember this, Zip Tree is near. This is your life. This is your dream. You're the master. You're the captain of your ship. Don't let anything or anyone take away that thing you want. But you've got to be willing to stand up to failure, stand up to pain, stand up to trials and tribulations, and decide within yourself that I will not stop until I get what I want. I will not stop in the middle of the process. I will not surrender. I will not be defeated. I will take everything that happens to me in my life and I will turn all the pain into my fuel for success. The hard times I'm facing might make it more difficult or inconvenient for me to get where I want to go, but it will not stop me. It will not determine my reality. I'm the only limit for what I can become and achieve. You have not seen the best days of your life yet. The best for you is still yet to come. You can do more, be more, have more. But you have to start living your life in expectation of great things. You gotta start expecting things to work in your favor in order for it to happen. If you live your life in positive expectations, that's what happens to you. But if you live your life in despair, that's what happens to you. Your journey, your fight, it's not gonna be easy. It's gonna test you push you, challenge you in ways you never imagined. But that's the beauty of it. That's where you find your true strength. You'll discover parts of yourself you never knew existed. Every challenge, every obstacle, every setback is an opportunity to grow stronger, to become more resilient. Your dreams are worth the struggle. Your goals deserve your dedication. They are worth the pain, worth the blood, worth the sweat, worth the tears. It may not feel like it right now in the middle of what you're going through but you will be glad you stuck it out. 
Let every no, every rejection, every failure drive you to do better. Let it be the reason you push harder, go further, reach, fire. I need you to embrace the journey with all its ups and downs. For it's in this journey that you find your true self, your unbreakable spirit, your unyielding determination. The road to success is littered with the stories of those who gave up too soon, who let their dreams slip through their fingers because they stopped when they were just a step away from greatness. You are stronger than you think, more capable than you know, and more resilient than you believe. Inside you lies the well of untapped potential waiting to burst forth, but it requires you to keep moving, to keep striving, and to keep saying to yourself, I will not stop. Today, make a pledge to yourself, a pledge that no matter how hard it gets, no matter how impossible it seems, you will keep going. You will face the storm, you will endure the pain, and you will overcome the challenges because you are a warrior. A champion, a dreamer who dares to fight for what they deserve. I'm not a failure. A failure is someone who's given up. I won't ever give up. I won't ever give in. Every single one of these obstacles in your way is an opportunity in disguise. The greatest achievements often arise from the ashes of our greatest struggles. The night is always darkest just before dawn. And it is in this darkness that your light has the chance to shine the brightest. There's gonna be things that go on that are out of your control. The worst thing you can do is let something that's out of your control control you. Get control of yourself, get control of your emotions. Don't get angry, don't get frustrated. Instead, stay calm and figure out how to move forward. You are closer than what you think! You're close and the devil done told you! Just get a divorce, you're close! Hold on! You close! You about to drop out! You going too far now! You ain't got but two credit! Hold on! You with three kids in! You can't quit now! Hold on! But this is my sixth time taking it! You gonna pass on the salad! Hold on! But you better get something from all that hell you been through! I'm talking to somebody! You ought to get excited! We were a hundred yards away! You are a hundred yards away! You can see it in the distance! You can see it in the distance! You close, boo, don't give up now! You close, my brother, hold on. I don't care if you have to inch your way day by day, even if you have to crawl, even if it hurts like hell, even if it's harder than anything you've ever been through. And nobody can see what you're really going through. And people are laughing at you, and they're doubting you. If you don't quit, this pain, this tragedy, this trial, this will become your greatest moment of growth. This is what makes a champion. I'm telling you right now, your lowest moment will be the birthplace of your biggest success. Even when everything inside of you screams that you stop, you've got to keep fighting. Fight through the tears. Fight through the storms. Fight through the battles with your family. Fight through the battles with yourself. Fight through whatever is in front of you and don't ever stop fighting. What you're going through right now is necessary. You are forging the skills. You are forging the determination. You are forging the grit. You are forging the fortitude. You are forging all the things that nobody else is gaining because they're sitting on their hands and you're willing to push through. And it's not going to be easy. If it was, everybody would do it. But I know you have the ability to make it happen. You gotta learn how not to give up or how not to give in. But you gotta find your why. And you gotta understand that greatness is within you. And you gotta pull it out. You gotta cross every mountain. You gotta pick up all the way. You gotta cry if you got to. But whatever you do, you cannot give up. You cannot give in. And if you give up and give in, you will never experience greatness. So keep going. If we can realize that life is always happening for us, not to us, game over, all the pain and suffering disappeared. And realize, if it was easy, everybody would do it. Nobody ever said it would be easy. I know, I know greatness is within you, and you got what it takes. So get up, and let's make it happen. You'll constantly keep moving, you'll constantly keep getting better so that you are never stuck in one place for the rest of your life. You're gonna find a way, or make a way. 
and you'll stop at nothing to get it. This is Ben Lionel Scott telling you, no matter how hard it is or how hard it gets, declare to yourself, I'm going to do whatever it takes to win.